Our overall goal as a program is to ease the burden that cancer brings to our communities. It starts with prevention and the promotion of healthy lifestyles. The Rivers Cancer Center was created in 2007 with the goal of easing the burden that cancer brings to people and our communities. We provide comprehensive cancer care and expertise in a compassionate environment close to home. We offer guideline-based comprehensive care in an organized manner. We personalize that care and help patients navigate through the system. We keep up to date. We consider all our patients for clinical trials, something that might be better than what's currently available. We focus on early detection and prevention programs. And we try and provide all this high quality care close to home. When I had my biopsy surgery here uh, by Dr. Clayton, when he called to let me know that I did have cancer, he, it was a Thursday afternoon, and he called to let me know that my diagnosis was lymphoma. Then he said, I made an appointment for you tomorrow morning with our oncologist. Do you want to keep that appointment? Everything was happening so fast. It was a really big plus for me. At the Rivers Cancer Center, I'm the nurse navigator that works with our cancer patients from the time they're diagnosed through their treatment. I work with the surgeons and I work with the oncologist to get them through their treatment. I think that it's really important to have a care coordinator or a care navigator because when you are diagnosed with cancer, you're facing a lot of different things that you've never heard about before or know about. For a patient with a newly diagnosed cancer, it's probably one of the most overwhelming things they'll ever face in their life. There's a lot of choices that they have to make. Um, in a relatively short amount of time, they're not experts in cancer, so a lot of information comes their way. It's on the internet. Uh, their friends and family give them advice. So it is a time where it, it's overwhelming and then you have to deal with the fact uh, of the question that you just have cancer in general. The staff cares about each individual patient. I remember my first appointment I ever had with an oncologist, uh, Amy came, the nurse navigator came to the appointment as well to help take notes because she knew how emotional I was feeling at the time and wouldn't remember half of what my doctor was telling me. I go with them to their initial consult visits with the surgeons, with the oncologist. I bring my level of expertise into the room so when they're dealing with the emotional aspect of their diagnosis, I can be listening for the different treatment things that need to be done so that I can help coordinate that care. Technology is a great tool if you have a minimally invasive operation that you can do with uh, some of the technology that we have in this room, the robotic technology. If it helps a patient recover faster, get back to work, get back to their daily routines, or get into the next phase of their cancer treatment. It would have been impossible for me to drive an hour or more to the cities or Mayo to get any kind of treatment. Uh, River Falls is a 15 minute drive from my house. So I was able to get here every day. I was also on a lot of medication that made me unable to drive, so I needed to be able to find rides for all my appointments as well. So a big deal was the location. Another big deal was how great everyone was at getting my appointments done right away and uh, helping me through my treatment. I think it's unique that patients can be treated close to home and still have all the specialties right here in River Falls for our diagnosis, treatment, all of that can be done locally. We can do this better than anybody else because we know our patients. We can contact them right after we hear about uh, their diagnoses and uh, we can get the experts uh, together in short order. I felt like everybody really knew my name and knew what was going on with me. I wasn't just a case file, but I was a person. Uh, they were concerned with how I was feeling um, emotionally and physically and helped me work through a lot of the different scary emotions that I have and how frightening it was to be going through cancer treatment.